first prize, written by Jenny Lewis. Trevor, the traction engine, was dozing in the vicarage orchard, enjoying the late summer sunshine. His driver, Jem Cole, arrived with a bucket, cloth and polish. There is a steam engine rally at the village show, and I think that you will win the best kept engine competition, he said. When his driver had finished cleaning, Trevor looked splendid in all his brass, glistening in the sunshine. Edward arrived on the line that runs past the bottom of the orchard. My word, Trevor, Edward commented. Don't you look marvellous? I'm sure you will win the prize at the show. Edward was on his way to the station to pick up a trailer full of tables for the fruit and vegetable competitions at the show. He also had to take a trailer containing two special passengers and two of the farmer's donkeys were going to the show to give children rides. Good luck, Trevor, called Edward as he set off for the station. Not long afterwards, the vicar came running down the orchard to where Trevor and his driver were getting ready to set off for the show. We need your help, Trevor. Edward has broken down and cannot get to the station to pick up the tables and donkeys for the show, explained the vicar. Trevor shoveled off to the station yard where he was hooked up to a trailer full of tables. He set off down a narrow muddy lane that led to the showground to deliver the, tr the tables. Then Trevor went back to the station yard for the donkeys. But the donkeys didn't want to get into the trailer. Hurry up, pleaded Trevor. I'll miss the competition if you carry on being so stubborn. Joan Cole had an idea and he hurried off to find some carrots. These will do the trick, he said, and put the carrots in the trailer. The donkey saw the carrots and jumped into the trailer straight away. Trevor set off down the muddy lane again and soon reached the show ground. He caught sight of his reflection in the water as he passed the boating lake and was horrified. Oh goodness, I'm covered in mud! I can't enter the competition now, he cried. Never mind, said Jem Cole, we can have the donkeys give rice to the children instead. And that's exactly what they did. The next day, back in the orchard, the vicar came to see Trevor and tied a big red rosette with a first on the centre onto his funnel. This is for the children who think that you are the very best traction engine ever. Trevor was delighted and wore the rosette all day.